What's your party trick? Uh, I can do a mouth trumpet. Now you're going to ask me to do the mouth trumpet, aren't you? Etc. Etc. <laughs> theatres and cinemas, I will um, happily tell people to, to stop breathing loudly. When I go to a restaurant, another very annoying habit, I'll spend a lot of time moving tables uh, to get the right one. It drives people up the wall. <laughs> oh, there's been many. When I was a kid, I never recovered from this. I was trying to show off to a girl and I told her I could get the ketchup from the bottom to the top and I stood up and I swung it around my head in this girl's like dining room, it was the main room of the house and I plunked it in front of her and there was no, there was no ketchup in the bottle and there was a perfect ring all the way around the carpet, the picture, the light shade, the ceiling <laughs> and, and there was about 20 people in the room as well, it was all my friends, it was like a party so um, you can imagine everyone just just laughing and laughing and the parents crying and crying. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> I don't know why, because I've got so many now it's stupid, but my mum and dad have instilled in me the habit of taking the free shampoo and shower gel. And now I spend so many time so much time in hotels. I now have this like ridiculous bag of the stuff and I never use it and it sits under my bed. Definitely not told many people, let alone in the interview. Why did the scarecrow win the competition? Because he was outstanding in his field. If you could hear the torrent, huge amounts of laughter in this room, but you, you're not allowed to hear that. I'm the only one with the mic. <laughs>